here we have a sub D surface of the saddle. It was based from a scan. I then made some boundary meshes where I want to grow onto. I have a field of density where you see that I want to have more density in this area and then fade gradually away. Here you see my design iterations with variable densities all over. Test out the look. You see how it grows to this boundary geometry. So the higher density in this area becomes more visible now. Check the other side. And this is the single surface of the final model. So it's just one sheet without thickness. And the final model you have seen in the rendering on both sides. It was a process of maybe two hours of iterations, playing around with the values until I got the result I liked.